Hello, online pipe community. Ethan, Parsimonious Piper here. It is Cobb Tuesday. Got my Cobb Tuesday Cobb. Back to my Cobb Tuesday hat. Today's Cobb is a Missouri Mearsham Country Gentleman, and in it, I have some Cascadia Vertical Limit. Now this stuff comes as a very, very dense plug. It says it's uh, Burley, Kentucky and Virginia. With an anise topping. Now mostly what I taste is the Kentucky And the burly, that combination. If the word anise scares you because you don't like licorice, I don't really taste licorice so much. As there's kind of a dark sweetness, like if... I don't know. Uh, maybe it's analogous to the way carob, what carob is to chocolate. It has some of that cocoa flavor, but not the sweetness. This is kind of like that to uh, to the anise, the, the licorice. Maybe it's like licorice and molasses had a love child or something. It's just a dark sweetness, but it's not sweet, sweet. And I taste it more if I put the bit all the way back in the back of my mouth. Let that smoke wash over the back part of my tongue first. For whatever reason, I taste it more back there. Just the same way that sometimes you taste sour back there on the sides and rear of your tongue. Mm. Now, it is a little moist, so it, it's taken me some relights to keep this lit. I cube cut it and then rubbed out just a little bit of it for kindling, but that, that, and didn't give it any real dry time. So it, it, it's moist. It'll take a little attention. But it's worth it. That is good. Now, would I buy it again? Not unless it's on sale. Just because I can't buy it in bulk. Now, if I could catch it on sale, sure, I'd get this again in a heartbeat. <clears throat> it's good stuff. David, St. David's Pipes, asked us to share Thanksgiving memories. He kind of left that wide open, good, bad, ugly. <clears throat> well, my fondest Thanksgiving memories would be from last couple of years of high school into college. Grew up a military brat, so we lived all over. Spent the last two years of uh, high school in Belleville, Illinois, across from St. Louis. Now, we'd never lived, never lived north of the Mason-Dixon line <laughs> uh, in my life, except for the, the years in Germany, but not here in the U.S. But both of my folks are from St. Louis, so all of our extended family, well, most of them, were there anyway. Christmases were always spent at my grandparents, but Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving was my mom's. We would have the dining room table, the kitchen table, two or three card tables, all set up with chairs around them. And people uh, piling plates off of the smorgasbord on the counter for us. Thanksgiving was always turkey. I know some people don't like turkey, so they do ham or something else, but ham's Christmas. 
Thanksgiving is uh, is turkey. But all the usual trimmings, the sweet potato casserole, the green bean casserole. Yeah, you can take anything healthy and make it taste good. <laughs> it's not usually healthy by the time you're done with it. Uh, the pumpkin pie. Sometimes one of my aunts was just she was genius with pies and sometimes she would bring over other apple or peach or whatever she happened to have that were just fantastic pies. But the food was always good. The company was always good. We had cousins and grandparents and aunts and uncles all crowded into our house. The place just packed and it was noisy A lot of laughter. When things started to wind down and dessert had been served and my mom was making the second or third pot of coffee. We'd kind of divide up. Some of the folks had settled in the family room watching a football game. Those are always teams I could care less about, though. You know, the Cowboys, the Packers, the Lions, the Bears. The who? Yeah. So I'd be at the opposite end of the house. We're about half the group or so would gather around, and I'd sit down at the piano, and we'd sing some traditional hymns. I would take requests to sing songs that I had sung in church. It's a precious time. Those were uh, those are good hours. So there you have it, David. Those few years before my parents moved up to New York and I went off to grad school, those few years are probably my favorite Thanksgivings. So that, that same scenario played out for a number of years in a row. And it was just, it was fantastic. I hope you all have some good Thanksgiving memories as well. I know there are some other countries that celebrate Thanksgiving not exactly for the same reasons or the same time frame as we do, and some of y'all don't really have a dedicated Thanksgiving celebration, but you still have good reasons to be thankful. And I hope you have good memories of celebrating exactly that. With that, light something you like. Might be this vertical limit. It's pretty good. Enjoy your afternoon.